hey guys welcome back to another video today we're going to be playing some bed wars the 4v4 mode it's very interesting because oh it's like 1v1 but instead there's four players on each team instead of one like a solo match i like it because there's not so many teams to manage and the teams are still good unlike before where they can tend to be a little bit more um newbie like me it gives me more of a challenge so we're going to be playing it and seeing how it goes i'm gonna help my teammate oh he's already done with that now i am playing on optifine 18.2 so, yeah, it's a little bit glitchy, because I've been having some things where the blocks kind of glitch me. I'm going to try and make this jump. Good thing. Oh, dear. Oh. Oh, <laughs> he fell. <laughs> Guess he isn't as good as parkour with stuff like that. And I guess he isn't good as parkour. I guess no one's here, so I'm going to go collect those diamonds. Looking at it, it should probably be at least four. I guess it's eight. Makes sense. Looked like eight. Can't really count. I played a little bit of Bed Wars before, so I've been able to identify usually about how much I've s items have been stacked now I'm not really trying to win this match I'm just trying to have fun and introduce something new to the channel but it is called mine ng blocks which stands for minecraft beam ng and roblox gonna buy some wool so in case anyone's like trying to follow me over a bridge or anything I can just place two wool blocks down and they can't get past so it's pretty pretty smart to get wool at all times I'm also gonna finish this bridge with some of the wool I may get shears I don't know they're definitely not a waste of money but Sometimes I don't want to use too much of it because I could also. Well, I already have chainmail, don't I? Well, maybe. Maybe I can shift and get this last block there. I should be able to just build here and there. Now we have a route to diamond generator. I wish it wasn't from middle, so it'd be a little bit more um, private, but it's as good as it'll get. I'm gonna go back to base and spend these diamonds on probably haste. Okay, I think that's the only thing I can afford. Oh, this already have haste. You know, what, I'll get. You know, what, I'll. Am I? Yeah, I think chest is good. Might. Yeah, try to save up for iron armor. Then I can get an iron. Iron armor so I can fight. After that I'll get an iron sword. I'm not really that good with fighting so I'd rather have armor so I can last longer than... Wait, I think someone's rushing. We didn't have any endstone? How did someone put endstone? Rule one of Bed Wars, you always get endstone first. You do that before you bridge, you do that be before you do anything else. Then step two, if you have 40 iron, you get a fireball. Do some trolling. It's also good if you need to break connections with some place. Like if someone's coming over to you, you can fireball them off and break connections with the outside. Also, I'm going to show you what my skin looks like. 
in a second. But that's how you use fireballs. This is what my skin looks like. It says sheep hoodie, and well, oh, he's he's destroying my teammates. <laughs> okay, this is why you always buy wool, so that if you're not good with PVP, you can just sit up here and bridge and stuff. I know I'm not gonna win this game. I mean, not even that good at fighting. I can dodge this. Woo! Oh dear. Oh, okay. Four hearts, nothing too bad. Gonna make double bridge. Looks pretty nice, like a staircase. I think someone's fire went out. Maybe it was from when I fireballed. Oh. Wait, he has jump boost, doesn't he? It looks like it. That was build height. That was really pointless. Where is he? Oh, he fell off himself. <laughs> I can't believe he actually fell off. And you didn't even get the kill. Like, that's so sad. Imagine fireballing yourself with jump boost that you spent an emerald on and then not even Okay, I'm just gonna finish off strong. Okay. Well, that was me trying Bed Wars. Hope you enjoyed the video.